So if you run any type of affiliate programs or you promote a lot of different links to your website, digital products, or digital resources, this tool right here, I wish I knew about when I first got started. It has saved me so much time and mental complexity that you can get into as you build out more and more links. I'm gonna walk you through why short.io is probably one of my favorite tools on the internet and it's free for everything I need. Plus it does so much to help me just stay organized and have a great experience, especially when it comes to affiliate links. Let's get into it. First, let's go through short.io. Straight up, it's a very simple website that basically uses your domain to shorten links and make all the links a little bit easier to look at. So for example, when you sign up for an affiliate program, they give you some weird links. Sometimes it's really long. Sometimes it's kind of just confusing and random, but this helps you connect it to your domain. So for me, I use go.davidalex.com. It's a subdomain. But anything I link to that, for example, go.davidalex.com forward slash consult or forward slash products takes you to a unique link that I want you to go to. Let me show you what that looks like on the back end. So here you can see a bunch of the different links I have. So for example, for Riverside and my affiliate program with them, if I go into here and I click edit, you're gonna see there's a few core things. First of all, the URL here is go.davidalex.com forward slash Riverside. You can customize go anything you want. As a subdomain, you can set it up any way you like. In this case, I got go.davidalex.com. And then Riverside is the unique identifier for this specific use. And so in this case, we got the URL slug, the link slug is Riverside. That's what this is here. The title doesn't really matter. But the original URL, which you can see here, is all this stuff, which is a whole lot. I don't wanna post that and publish that everywhere. And the biggest hurdle is, this has happened a lot too, which you don't think it's gonna happen, but it has happened a lot, which is sometimes these companies change their third-party tool that they use, their vendor that they use for the affiliate program. And so one might use Impact and then switch to Partner Stack or go from Partner Stack to Rewardful or something else. And so you gotta bear in mind that they may change that and that means your link changes. Well, not a big deal, right? Wrong. It is a huge deal because when you maybe are like me and you have a YouTube channel and every single one of your videos has all these links in them, you then have to somehow go in there and fix, you see all these links, like you have to somehow go in here and fix all these links. And that's a lot of work. And there are workarounds for this. If you use uh, TubeBuddy, which I have installed here, you could use a replace feature, which is nice. But the reality is when you go in here and you see these links, these are way easier to work with because this link is here and I could have this link in a thousand places, but if I need to change the source URL, which you can see here, the original URL, I just change it here once and it changes it across the entire internet for me. This is super powerful and really user friendly once you get started. You can see here pricing, I use it for free and there's literally no issue. Link automations, branded total links up to a thousand. Like these numbers are great. I've never even gotten close to this. And even if I did have to pay $5 a month, like this is totally worth it for what it does for me and what it builds. So the first thing is you need to link a domain. So in this case, I have this domain here. If I click add a domain, gives you a few options um, on how you can do that. You can buy one, but you can add your own. So I'm gonna click here. So in this case, I would type in something like, let's say go.cmo.com if I want to set that up. Then I'll hit add domain. And then from this point, we need to configure the domain. So if I hit configure here, it's gonna take you through a process. And so it'll ask you to sign into GoDaddy. And then from there, you'll look at the instructions. So here you'll come in how to set up the domain. You'll find your registrar. In this case, I'll say it's GoDaddy. And then down here, you'll go through the process where you need to go to manage DNS records. And then you need to add in two records, which will be 
let's see here's one record click add new record so you're gonna add this type a and then this value here which will look something like this and then you need to add in your own domain which it walks you through that process here which we've already done part of this and so we'll keep going so in this case because it has a connection with godaddy it wants to create this connection for me so i don't even have to set up the dns records but i would just hit connect and just like that it's gonna be able to connect this subdomain with short.io which is great and just like that it'll work it'll take a little bit of time to load like this may need a moment to refresh but in 10 minutes or so it'll be set up and then the way you add in your urls is really easy actually so let's just say i have a url which goes to my channel so let's just grab my url right here and then i'm going to go in here and just paste the url of wherever i want it to go boom just like that it's created it and then i could change the slug here to be whatever i want so in this case it's going to be go.myflexcml.com forward slash youtube you can hit copy here and then use that i'm just going to hit save and then close and boom it's set up so it's going to track all the clicks every time it, it gets used and then i could go to my video or wherever and then just type in info about my channel visit here boom paste that in and now that link will work literally forever on any platform i never have to change it even if i change my youtube channel or i want to push traffic somewhere else i could easily do that without having to worry about the url this works so well for affiliate programs as you can see here any of these links if i just go to it copy it and paste it you're gonna see the URL changes to betterment.com forward slash refer, uh, friend referral offer, question mark referral key, David Iskander. Boom, now it's just done that. Boom, it even has my name here, which is awesome. <laughs> but just like that, it's able to change it. Um, and then the same thing here, if I go to TDO, I copy this, paste it, you're gonna see the link change to their official like setup. Boom, and just like that, we were able to set it up. Short.io is a really, really powerful tool to create tons of links for your business and never have to worry about changing it. I have gone through the stress and hassle of trying to do this two or three times on my YouTube channel because links just had to change or things had to change. And they do have this bulk feature for TubeBuddy where you could find and replace, but you have to pay for their account. And then it just doesn't always work perfectly because you may type it differently in different places, whatever. But to go through 400 videos and do it for every video is like ridiculous. But to be able to do it once in one place is amazing. So I highly recommend short.io. The link will be down below for you to access it. Uh, and with that, if you guys have any other questions on that or need other tools and resources, definitely check out subscribing as I help businesses, small and medium sized businesses grow online. And with that, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.